Hi, my name is David, otherwise known as the iBook Guy. Let me tell you a little bit about what I do. I'm very fond of the first generation iBook known as the Clamshell and the second generation known as the Snow iBook. I buy these laptops in huge bulk lots, often with various problems. In my spare time, I repair these computers and get them ready for people to use. Then I resell them on eBay and also in my local part of town using Craigslist. Let's look over the basic features of these computers. I'll start with the clamshells. There were four different colors and three different speeds. eBay sellers are always getting this mixed up and advertising these things wrong, so let me clear things up a bit. The first clamshells were the Blueberry and Tangerine. Both units were 300 MHz and do not have firewire ports. These are the most common ones found on eBay. Next, they came out with the Graphite model at 366 MHz. Next, they introduced the Indigo and the Key Lime units, which were 366 MHz and also added firewire ports. The last clamshells made were the Special Edition Graphite and Key Lime models, which had 466 MHz processors. These are very rare and hard to find. In fact, in all the bulk lots I've bought, I've never come across one. The most common mistake I see is eBay sellers confusing the Blueberry and Indigo models. The easiest way to tell them apart is to find out if it has a firewire port, because only the Indigo model has one. After the clamshell was discontinued, the next iBook is informally known as the Snow iBook. There were over 20 versions of this, and they're very difficult to tell apart. The first version used a 500 MHz CPU, and the last version used a 1.42 GHz CPU. Even though they all look the same, there are considerable differences internally. I typically just deal with the 500 and 600 megahertz versions. Besides repairing them, I also upgrade them. Keep in mind these computers are old. In fact, without some upgrades, they're virtually useless for today's online world. It actually amazes me that I see some of these things being sold on eBay sometimes for hundreds of dollars without any upgrades at all because the seller will use deceptive advertising. They'll use words like, comes with a huge three gigabyte hard drive for storing all of your music. But the truth is, a three gigabyte hard drive is barely big enough to do a minimal install of the operating system and there would be no space left over for any music or any other applications to be installed. I've also seen phrases like, upgraded to 128 megabytes for speedy performance. Again, the truth is 128 megabytes is horrible and can barely boot a modern operating system, much less give speedy performance. So, in order to make these things usable in the modern world, I upgrade the memory, the hard drive, the operating system, I make sure it has an airport card. I also give you a working power supply. It is amazing how many eBay auctions are selling these computers without a power supply, which is crazy. Another common scam to look out for is sellers who advertise their iBook as wireless ready or something to that effect. It makes it sound like it includes the wireless card, but what it really means is that there is no wireless card included. You won't find any of these fraudulent claims in my advertising. 